Hey, it's Jay. I'm here in the living room today to talk about moving our bones. Humans have to move to stay alive, and muscle is the motor that causes the movement. Skeletal muscle is under voluntary control. If I want to eat this pear, I control skeletal muscle to move it the way I want to. I don't control how my heart pumps blood or how food moves along the intestine. Cardiac and smooth muscle aren't under voluntary control. Skeletal muscle is attached to bone at an origin and an insertion. The origin is the less movable attachment, and the insertion is more movable. In the case of the brachialis, the origin is on the humerus, and the insertion is the forearm. If I contract the brachialis, the insertion moves toward the origin. This is a motion called elbow flexion. A muscle can exert force only to shorten. That's because the motor proteins are organized so that they only pull the edges of the sarcomere toward the center. If I want the brachialis to lengthen, some other force has to produce the movement. In this case, I'm going to relax the brachialis, and gravity lengthens the muscle. This is a motion called elbow extension. Now, I can also actively extend the elbow. In this case, I relax the brachialis and use a muscle with an origin and insertion on the opposite side of the bone. This would be the triceps brachii. Muscles move bones at joints. A joint is a place where bones meet. If we look at the elbow, there are actually three bones that meet. We can talk about this as a single joint for simplicity. Elbow allows flexion and extension, but an elbow doesn't allow movement of the forearm laterally or medially. There are structures that prevent that movement. Joints can allow different amounts of movement. For example, the joints between cranial bones and the skull allow no movement at all. You can look at the sagittal suture or coronal suture. A joint like my shoulder can allow lots of movement. It allows flexion, extension, lateral and medial movement, and also rotation in both directions. We're going to talk about different types of joint movement in a follow-up video. What are the take-home messages from this video? Skeletal muscles are under voluntary control and attached to bones at an origin and an insertion. An origin is the less movable attachment. Insertion is more movable. Muscles are the motors that cause the movement. Joints have structures that determine what types of movement can occur.